Welcome back. I know I said my last video was going to be the last video, but this quest has been sticking on my mind, so I have to get to the bottom of it. So, the champion's tunic hitting in the throne room of Hyrule Castle. So, we gather after beating Ganon in the last video. The, the world doesn't return to normal, so you can't keep playing after you beat Ganon. So, that's fair enough. Some games do that. Where is the castle? But... What if I can still go into the castle? So that was a theory I had, and I want to put it to the test now. So I want to see, can I, one, make it to the castle somehow or other. Via either skydiving like I am now, or... Can I get at least along the grounds and use a pine cone or something that will get me up to where the... The waterfall is and I'll use the Zora armor to scoot in however it is looking like I will probably be able to make it to the castle this time. I don't know why I never thought of this before but I guess this will be a little bit of fun now to explore the remains of the castle it feels really small from up here I wonder is it going to be Plague now with like big ass linos and stuff. Yeah. Grand job we're here, so that mystery was a lot easier. This almost presented like it's a, a, a dungeon. Like the one F and giving me floor numbers. But we can expect that this is likely the throne room sanctum so maybe not the throne room so I'd say a, a shrine will appear here eventually that's the throne looking thing to me right where's the torches what was the oh there they are the quest said hidden throne room how she wrote the torches of the key but what does that mean right, so there's two torches um, I'll just use this quick. And I'm going to dismiss that big lad because he's really doing my head in. Whoa! We've got a wild, a rogue ball. Now let's just uh, dismiss my big robo sage. Minoru, that's her, yeah. Is he really getting in the way? Okay. Oh, there's a little chest in here now. Is this going to be my armor? Champions that so it's pretty much just the armor from the last game. They used to be such as new shoulder guard. Uh, okay. There's a small sense of disappointment. So all of that filling around just to get the armor from the first game. In Breath of the Wild. I'm upset myself I hadn't figured this out sooner. It was only it was obvious, I suppose. But I guess I assumed that Ganon was going to be up in the top of the castle. I didn't think he'd be hanging around in the... In the depths. But I guess he likes it down there. He doesn't want Tyrell Castle. But he always did in the past. That's what definitely threw me off. Otherwise, I probably would have thought this long ago. But sure, while we're up here, let's have another scoot around and see what surprises await us. I think I have enough swords now. I'll survive without them. There's bound to be other secrets apart from just that royal hour, that uh, reworked tunic. This was Tony Hawk's on that. It'd be great all lump ramp to go down. to latch onto ladders. It's questionable. Maybe not up here anyway. I think getting the height's good though. It'll give you a better scope of the area down below. So there is like a, a peak. There is a, a main spire like a a highest point of the castle. It's down there. Oh Jesus. 50 damage. 
Uh, well, uh, I think we see the obvious one to replace. Royal Guards bow. Let's just climb up the old fashioned way. The suspenseful music's making it all the more spooky to be up here. Something's got to make that shrine appear too. Whoa, money, money! Not that I need any more. Uh, well, there is like a bell tower. Tip. I think maybe I could get up this way. And then climb over. Actually, maybe I'll stand on this. It looks flat. Yes. Give me a hook shot. Oh, I don't know if I'll be able to get through this bit though. Maybe I gotta climb up that spire. It's covered in gloom though. I suppose I could get up as high as I could and then swing over. Because there's, there's only so much gloom. Oh no. It's gloom ridden. How far up to the peak can he go? Oh, hold on. I could probably go in there and uh, uplift over, couldn't I? That makes more sense. It'd be much easier to get there, too. Well, I'm assuming I can uplift. No, stop. Yes, indeed. See where I end up now. And there's a chest. Two chests. Two chests. Two, two chestesses. That's a pretty high base damage for any uh, ruined weapon. And this side fire. And if I ring the bell. That was definitely not what I was expecting to be the outcome of that bell. I thought it might have been what would make the shrine appear down below. A long way down. Can I go any higher? He might make that, let's see. Very, uh... Like a door with a purpose. No. Just a cosmetic slab. I think really loves to do the climbing. Alright, let's go up to the peak. They're definitely not meant to be openings. I will climb down the other side though if, there's, if it turns out there is nothing. A dust bow. I don't know the strength of my current bow. I don't know which one I have equipped. Uh, that's got the extra attack up. Even with the double shot. The duplex is handy because it shoots two. I only that makes 28, but still, I'll drop the demon bow and pick up the dust bow. Oh, I made a mistake. Oh well. Is there anything to uplift to here? They are cramming their secrets around the heights, so. They definitely wanted someone to eventually climb up here. If Nintendo included, like, achievements and trophies in their game. There would undoubtedly be a trophy for this. Can he stand on this? Nope. I've gone and put myself into an awful dangerous position. No, I'm alright. 
on, let's get to the tip. Hold on, looks like there's another Korok up here. Well, I gotta get that Korok. Wonder what that is over there. Is that the Gerudo Desert? That's nothing. That's uncharted territory. Perhaps an expansion. Or is that the Lost Woods? I'll get to the tip and I'll, I'll make a better observation then. Right, no jumping. I think that's what caused the trouble the last time. What a view. You see the town below. Oh, and I don't have any more stamina drain. Alright, so what could this be? How do I get back out to the world map? X. Yeah, I think it is the Korok Forest. Alright, nothing mysterious so. Now where to? Oh, there's a... Is that on here? Let me just fly down and grab that one. And I'll do a bit more exploration then. I'll just activate it. I won't do it. But at least I'll have a fast travel point to get back here if I ever... Decide to come back. I'm sure there'll be DLC in the future. I think this game sold like... 10 million in three days, so I think Nintendo would be crazy to not make DLC. I would like better DLC than what was for Breath of the Wild, though. It was like a rehash of the same dungeons. Oh, there's lots of them in here, isn't there? Where's you, Roly? Oh, these guys are tough. There's no benefit in fighting them, really. It's a, they'll give me nothing. See a chest. Born Claymore. I'm sure we'll scour the lower levels and then I'll try and make it back into the castle again. I was hopeful they would have a, a restored castle though. Just because they've done it for all the other areas in the game. I know they've done that because they just had the data there from Breath of the Wild. Sure, since they'd already built a large portion of this game from Breath of the Wild, I think they could just go to the extra effort. More environments. Could be a disk space thing too. Pretty sure those carts only hold 32 gigs. There is a map of the castle, I guess. I can have a quick look at that now and see if I've not spotted anywhere. Ooh, what's over here? Ooh, that's a 70. Not that I ever use my shields. Well, this one's in the worst condition, so let's drop you. I'm all over the place. Nice one. I've all the best gear now. And uh, nothing to use it on. Oh, that's the... That's down. That was where I would have planned to use my Hillian Pinecone if I wasn't able to glide into the castle. That's it, dead end. Let's have us a quick peep, so and... It's like a partial hallway there. I would assume the pink is gloom. And then the one F is like the main. Can I get up there quickly just doing this? Wouldn't mind having one last little peep around the the main floor. And they're off. This has got a fierce looking uh, horn. Never catch me 
now. Okay. Oh. Just about made that one. I saw loads of glinty glittery bits. Princess Zelda study. Royal Guard's bow. Royal Guard sword. That's a good sword now. Good base damage. Do I get rid of? That's pretty crap, isn't it? So, bows. Well, I'll get rid of this. I can actually get rid of the dust bow because it wasn't the best, was it? Stats were disappointing. The stats. Oh wait, yeah, that's the second boy. Yeah, fifty. Grand job. You know, having that. No, I'm having two of them. Cozy little study. No uh, mysterious quest items though. I was hoping for some real wild side quest that I'd be rewarded with for my explorations here. That's still not to say there won't be one. I ain't done searching yet. Not quite yet. Looks like more. This is Zelda's room. They've trashed the place. It's riddled with spiders. Now. There's got to be a secret in this room. That another royal bow. It'll be wasted now because I'll end up uh, being down in the depths or something. Down in the depths using these high power bows for nothing more than shooting light bloom seeds. That's it though. Just a sword. The reason I want to just use the hand is that it might highlight something that I can interact with that I may have otherwise missed. Didn't bake the apple. Or beef to be claim more. Not that real big one. It's good base damage. Alright, an interesting room all the same. Let's see where she hangs out in the evenings. Another big heavy sword. Right, is there any more upstairs? This probably brings us back to 1F then. No, oh, 1F's a while away. But I'll be able to climb this exit. It's only a short climb up. Here we are. Back to the main throne room. Well, that little spot in the middle feels fishy. What's going on here? Like, why would they have a big pile of muck in the middle? Surely they'd be. That was a gladiator pit. That's where the boys used to go toe to toe. Throwing slaps. Well, that's it then. All observable, interesting parts of this castle have been explored. I've got my armor that was promised from Zelda all along. Which was very easy to find. And I don't think there's a whole lot else to see. Well look, at least that uh, part of the story settled itself. I'm happy to finish the side quest. 
I can leave this area satisfied now that I've closed the question. A loose end's tied up. And now I can do a... That looks like an interesting building. Right, I'll check out that one last building over there, because that one looks like it's got something interesting in it. Don't want to be leaving stones unturned. Oh, it even has a convenient door for me to glide down into. Just glancing the windows there, and obviously, is there anything going on? Any Lannisters getting cheeky with it? It's just a chest and some arrows. Royal Shield. I am flush with high powered shields at the moment. Just a soldier's bow. That was a good, uh, good amount of thrust there now. Second gatehouse. I'd say this brings back the all memories from Tears or Breath of the Wild. We end up having like Lionel boss fights in each of these. You can just walk straight into Hyrule Castle in there. Rest of the wild. Right, we'll get out of this gatehouse. That's the drawbridge out. So right below we should see a part of the road. There we go, eh? It's not for shame we can't return the castle back to normal. I'd love to be able to... I'd love to have had that as an exploration thing to do the side quests and help rebuild Hyrule Castle similar to how there was that quest to help rebuild that town the coast town the nice tropical one but anywho that's the end of Zelda hope I had fun anyway hope you enjoyed watching the videos I'll talk to you again